Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of John Matrix Talks Movies. If this is your first time visiting the channel, please hit subscribe to catch future videos from me. Today, who was the most powerful force user? Was it Yoda or was it Emperor Palpatine, also known as Darth Sidious? Yes, we're going to put them toe to toe together and see who comes out on top. Now, we did see Yoda and Palpatine go toe to toe at the end of Star Wars Episode 3, The Revenge of the Sith. And technically, Palpatine won that battle, even though it was pretty close. There was really no definitive winner at the end of that battle because Yoda pretty much just fell down as he was defle deflecting Force Lightning from Palpatine, and Palpatine fell down too. However, Palpatine did have the use of the clone troopers to pretty much wipe out the Jedi. And Palpatine, all of those years, he was right next to the Jedi, and yet none of them knew that he was a Sith Lord. None of them knew his weaknesses, but yet Palpatine knew all of the Jedi's flaws and weaknesses as well as their strength. His mind was immense. He was extremely smart, so I do think that Palpatine was actually smarter than Yoda. Yoda could not sense the dark side around him, but Palpatine could sense everything around the Jedi. Think about that. Yoda was pretty much outsmarted by Palpatine. So on that note, I'm going to give the edge in smartness to Palpatine. Now, however, when it comes to actual overall knowledge of the force, this is one I will have to give to Yoda. Now, the Sith Lords always wanted to find out how to obtain eternal life. Whereas the Jedi, at least with Yoda anyway, they were okay with death and Yoda knew how to come back to life, so to speak, after death as a force ghost. So he achieved a power greater than any other force user, you know, along with Obi-Wan Kenobi and uh, Anakin Skywalker, because they did come back as force ghosts as well. Palpatine never came back, but Yoda also has about a 940 year advantage on Palpatine. For over 900 years, he trained Jedi way before Palpatine was born. So his overall knowledge of the force is going to be much more immense. Now I would like to see, you know, Yoda around 200 years old and see what kind of knowledge he had and how much he grew. But Palpatine was a human. He learned a lot in a short amount of time. When it comes to lightsaber combat, I'm going to give the edge to Yoda because if you actually look at Star Wars Episode 3, The Revenge of the Sith, when Yoda ignites his lightsaber blade, Palpatine tries to run. And the reason is he knew that he had a much better advantage of defeating Yoda with a lightsaber if he got him into a smaller space. That is because Yoda does a lot of those jumps and flips everywhere. I don't remember the style of what it's called, but he could actually neutralize that by having Yoda in a smaller space. So Yoda definitely gets the edge when it comes to the physical abilities of using the force. I mean, he deflected force lightning with his hand. We haven't seen any other Jedi do that. And Yoda, like I said, 900 year advantage, he gets the edge there. Now, who wins the overall battle and who is better with the force overall, who is stronger when you put two and two together? I'm going to have to give the edge to Palpatine. Palpatine just outsmarted him. He just outsmarted him and all of the Jedi. Palpatine was working on this master plan. I'm willing to bet at least 20 years. And he was right there in the Senate. In the Senate working next to the Jedi and he wiped them all out. 
all of them. That was a quote from The Phantom Menace in case you didn't get that. But anyway, that's what I think about this. Who do you think was the most powerful force user, Yoda or Palpatine? Let me know your thoughts on this in the comments. If you're new here to the channel, please hit subscribe to catch future videos from me and we will catch you on the next video. John Matrix out.